Hoffman, fire score! Flyers fans are really missing games at the Wells Fargo Center right now. They score! Amid the pandemic, the Wells Fargo Center has been mostly quiet, except for very deserving frontline workers. Among them, Todd Kilbaugh and Kristen Laurie. Both work in the Pediatric Intensive Care Unit at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Please join us in thanking Kristen for her strength, courage, and selflessness in serving our community. My grandma was the diehard Flyers fan. So we would sit there together and watch the Legion of Doom. I grew up in Chicago, so I was a huge Blackhawks fan. Um, I moved here in the mid 2000s and um, started my only Philly team has really become the Flyers. This is part of the Flyers Frontline Families Initiative to honor those who've been working every day to keep our community safe and healthy. Each home game, the team invites a different diehard Flyers family to be the only fans in the Wells Fargo Center. During the pandemic, who has done more than our frontline workers? We want to celebrate them. We want to honor them. The kids just loved it. I mean, their eyes were like big and bright from the time we walked in. Gritty was the star of the show. <laughs> he was right next to us the whole time and really interacting with them. So that, that meant a lot to them. They felt really special. Since they were playing the Penguins, I had to initially uh, immediately tone down anything I was going to say to Sidney Crosby. The return of the NHL season in August and the Flyers' run in the bubble playoffs provided a sense of normalcy for frontline workers who needed it the most. You're working 15, 16 hours a day, every day, um, and the one sort of emotional release, then re-enter sort of life. <laughs> where you would eat for a few seconds and then you'd get to watch the Flyers. We see in them a lot of characteristics of the Flyers franchise and the Flyers team. Hard work, grit, determination. Frontline families can be nominated on PhiladelphiaFlyers.com and a family will be invited for every home game until the end of the season. Jim Rosenfield, NBC10.